Today is Electrical Safety Day, a day when schools around BC come together online to think about being safe around electricity. What an important day it is! But outside your school, things look pretty quiet. No cars coming down the street, nobody picking up the mail. What's the big deal about Electrical Safety Day? Let's take a closer look. A good example is electricity. We use it every day. Power lines are held above the ground by power poles. You'll see them almost everywhere we need electricity. You probably walked underneath some on your way to school today and didn't even notice. It's getting a bit windy out there. But before we continue, let's take a quick moment to have a discussion about power lines and the poles that hold them up. Power lines are held above the ground for our safety. The poles keep the power lines a safe distance from where people walk, but sometimes things can go wrong. What was that? A broken power pole and live power lines that have fallen in the street are both electrical safety hazards. It's 3 p.m. and school is letting out for the day. The electrical safety hazards have just been discovered by four students on their way home from school. Downed power lines are dangerous. Electricity could be flowing through the power lines that are lying on the ground. It looks like these students know the three keys to electrical safety. See if you can spot them. That's one key. The only way to be sure you're safe is to stay back. Assume all downed power lines are live. Keep at least 10 meters between you and a downed power line. It can be difficult to judge distance. 10 meters is about the length of a large school bus. Now they're looking up to make sure there's no danger of more power lines falling. And looking down to make sure there are no other power lines where they are standing. That's another key. Look up and look down. That's another key. When you're sure you're safe, call for help. Let's take a moment to discuss that important phone call. You can also call BC Hydro, but 911 is easier to remember. It's also important to remember the three keys to electrical safety. Look up and look down to make sure there are no hazards above or below you. And stay back. Don't do anything until you're at least 10 meters from a downed power line. 10 meters is further than you may think. It's about the length of a large school bus. Then you can use the third key. Call for help. Remember, it's 911. Thanks for taking part in BC Hydro's Electrical Safety Day. Help us spread the word about the three keys of electrical safety. Look up and look down. Stay back at least 10 meters. Then call 911 for help. Have a safe summer and always remember the three keys to electrical safety.